Hey guys, how is it going? Welcome back to another video on Injustice 2 Mobile. So we have the update 5.6 uh, release notes, uh, which are also known as uh, patch notes, available right now. So this means that you can go and download the game. Uh, the game probably won't start, but it's better to download it right now. You know, and uh, then whenever the update is done, you, know, you can directly log in and start playing. So you can just go in the Play Store. Uh, these uh, files will be already updated. You just need to go and download them. I think it's somewhere around 120 MB, not more. Uh, so yeah, so this is the contents of the update and the changes that they have made. Uh, it is here available right now. You guys can go and take a look at it. The link is also there on uh, Play Store. Uh, when you update the app, you just go on more and uh, then update the game. You just go on more and uh, click on that link and you will be here on this page all right guys so uh table of contents robin king arrives from uh, the dark multiverse okay new winter holiday login event bug fixes and more characters league rage solo rage ux and ui that means the uh, animation and stuff will change a little bit and then, then there is others okay so robin king as we all know he is uh, coming as a new legendary character along with the king complete your metal team and etc and etc <laughs> so we have already seen the fight the official uh you know gameplay for this particular character robin king so i don't need, think we need to go into detail about this particular character we already know it's going to happen now a uh, new winter holiday login event now this is something different don't miss the new limited time only winter holiday or login event Participate daily to earn special rewards, including orbs, credit, legendary hero shards. Okay, day 10. On day 10, uh, a new exclusive holiday profile picture and more. The special uh, will run for 12 days starting on December 14th. That means today. All right, guys. So these are the bug fixes that they have done. Classic Superman fixed the bug with the wrong healing. So people who are taking advantage of that healing effect in the arena and champions arena, now they won't be able to do that because they have fixed that bug. Uh, ruler of conduct black adam fixed the issue when adam can't reach the opponent after tagging him okay with basic attack okay this this i knew this again the black adam issue fixed the issue with adam when couldn't lock more than one opponent special okay uh fixed issue when disabled special effect was transferred to the next opponent uh if uh, the first special defeated the active opponent okay justice league dark swamp thing justice league dark fixed the wrong texture of low quality settings all right that was important satana fixed the bug with glowing vfx after burning effect on the opponent has ended yes this is this was something that i was looking forward to okay hawkman fixed redundant shield vfx during second special i have no hawkman available right now so i don't know what this is uh league rates moving on to the league rates update Updated Gorilla Grodd and Dr. Fate AI for 8 and 10 levels in the league range. A lot of people were looking forward for this. And it's finally updated. Now let's see if these bugs that have removed now. I don't think uh, there won't be any bugs. There will be bugs because this is an update. Because they're bringing in a new character. Alright, damage caps are now counted from Brainiac's phase health. Not from the total health. Oh, okay. Alright. This is nice. Okay, this might help you guys to do more damage, I guess. Fixed issue when hazards from the previous Brainiac's uh, phase transfer to the next one on 9 and 10 tiers. All right, now solo rage. Uh, daily changed daily attempts from 3 to 6 in solo rage. All right, guys. This, is, this could be the game changer because we usually have daily attempts. I, I think I, I'm not really sure what, these, uh, what this means. Because on a daily basis, we do get six attempts. You know, there is like you know, three in the morning and three in the evening. So that means it's six. Uh, let's say if they have fixed it and make, made it like six attempts per refresh. Uh, it's not clearly mentioned over here. You know, it's the same thing. Uh, so we just have to wait and see. Uh, fix the issue with infinite dark side super moves. Oh, okay. So that was an issue. I thought that was a passive. All right. So deleted null field modifier for Justice League, the Flash sub boss. All right, fixed issue with uh, when sub boss Nightwing and Vixen are stunned characters using. Oh, okay. All right, so this is the ancient judgment solar raid issues. So basically, you know, you basically there is a boss and a sub sub boss, basically Nightwing and Vixen, who basically stun your characters on basic attacks instead of specials. So that is what needed to be fixed. 
Ancient judgment turned out passive for dark side and Captain Cold sub bosses. All right. Fixed issues when Martian Man and the boss time up become broken after Raven's special. All right. On ice, fix the wrong attack value for boss Green Arrow. Sub boss Green Arrow. A bunch of fixes and bosses and sub bosses descriptions. Yeah, they had to do that. And there were a lot of bugs in Ancient Judgment. I have to say that. Artifacts. Fixed Mr. Freeze with Beta Club. Outputting reduced DOT damage. So he was actually kind of. You know, doing less damage uh, with Beta Club now, they've fixed that. And you know, if you guys have Beta Club and Mr. Freeze, then like it's it's silver and gold for you. A fixed Harley Quinn, Heartbreaker, Harley Quinn, DOT damage, not doing proper crit damage with Dark Metal Cards. Okay, see, okay, ruler. Fixed issues when Vera received damage buff when opponent used power bars. Okay, this is something I haven't really noticed. Uh, fixed bug when I don't have Sword of Sin, but still fixed bug when artifact power locked opponent instead of power drain. Ah, okay, this this was a shitty bug. Orb of Ra, fixed wrong values in texts. Okay, CRC fixed damage absorption values. I don't have the artifacts, so can't say for sure. Sword of Sin, I don't have again. Fixed bug when burn VFX was absent. All right, guys. Now finally at the end. But there are some changes maybe in the animation of uh, you know like logging in and something else and the ux and ui <coughs> are fixed i'm um, not fixed exactly they have like kind of updated it a little bit or changed it a little bit fixed timer and regular daily login calendar yeah that was that was supposed to do because they were showing like a full year's timer you know it should be monthly but it was showing yearly for some reason a fixed bug when menu becomes untrickable after fast scrolling gears in arena store yeah that i think i have faced that once or more than once i think ux updated sp readiness display for metal team all right ui updated ui animation in calendars now rewards now rewards items and seasonal daily login calendars are visible to users in all states all right league store ui added touch feedbacks to gear packs thank you thank you for that i don't know what this means but thank you all right guys fixed an issue with the crash after player taps on members Okay, yeah, the leagues had a lot of issues, you know, when basically, you know, the league used to get slow all the time when I was playing with my previous phone, but I thought that maybe the problem was on my phone, but it wasn't eventually, it was with the game. Fixed the issue with the game stuck when player taps on the purchase button in the operations menu. All right, some objective of injustice pass weren't translated into some languages. All right, all right. So this is decent, I guess. They haven't really done a good job with the, the previous update and there were a lot of bugs let's see you know the favorite one my favorite one is mr Fees's freak picks you know and uh let's see this uh, i have to see we have to see you know what exactly this means uh daily attempts from three to six in solo raids we usually get six attempts in a day man you know i, I don't really think it makes any sense right now we just have to wait and see all right, guys, so these were the patch notes for update 5.6. If you have any questions, any doubts, uh, just make sure you mention in the comments and I'll be more than happy to answer them to you. All right, guys, so thank you for your time. You guys have a great day ahead. Take care of yourselves. Be blessed and stay safe. Have a good one, guys. Bye-bye.